Right. Do you yeah. want me to mention him by name? I think so. Okay, why yeah. not? Yeah. <clears throat> of course, Lee is kind of a reclusive person, but I don't mind mentioning his name. We, can. we can't live forever. <laughs> All right. Ready? Yeah. James Irwin was the command pilot on Apollo 13. On a, pardon me, on Apollo 15. Uh, James, after his return from the moon, became a born-again Christian. At one point, he came to Nashville, Tennessee, to give a lecture on Christianity and his conversion there, too. And at that time, he met a local Nashville resident by the name of Lee Galvani. Well, Lee implored James Irwin to confess to tell the truth about the Apollo hoax, of which Lee was convinced. Well, evidently, he made some inroads in, into Jim Irwin's conscience because in August of 1991, James Irwin called me at my home. And he said, I understand you've written a, a, a book called We Never Went to the Moon. He says, come to think of it, this phone could be tapped. He says, I want you to call me at my home on Friday in, in, uh, in uh, Colorado Springs, Colorado. So I said, okay, Jim, I'll call you. And he gave me his home phone number. Well, when I called him on Friday, James Irwin was dead. He had died of a heart attack. 